Part two is now in session. Let's go ahead and get to where we last left off. Drew Franklin is our guest. With me is Drew Franklin. And guys, there are a few tapes in here that I might keep from January 10th's update, like Small Soldiers and one other. But um, these are the following that uh, the other following that I might. Oh, except these two. Sorry. These are the following that um, I will keep from January 10th update besides the Israeli types. Annie, the rest I'm going to get rid of. This one looks pretty bad, though. Mm, mm, you know, I might not keep this. I might get a new copy, actually. Yeah. Next one I'm only going to keep because it's so rare. Tom 5 UK Beach Star Trek Factory. Probably when I get a better copy, I'll get rid of this one. But for now, I'm going to keep it to show it exists. This one's molded like crazy. October 27, Tom 5. I'm just not going to pop the tape in because it'll do damage to my PAL VCR. And my PAL VCR is already not doing so well. So definitely not going to do that. Drumstick looks okay on this one. Uh, print date. Is October 1st, 2003. <clears throat> Got Oliver. Still able. I want to keep that one. That one looks fine. Ink, but there's no print date. Uh, where did. I... Oh, the. And. Scooby Doo in the Witch Hunt. I mean, Witch Goat. Which is Goat. Warner Home Video UK Limited. Piece in the row. Film strip looks good, though. August 17, 2002. Alright. Yeah. Mickey and Minnie. Mexican Spanish. And guys, if I'm missing any, I do truly apologize if I'm missing any others. November 22nd, 2001. Really, the molded ones are the only ones I'm getting rid of. Mexican Spanish for Bugs Life. Also, a Mexican Spanish for Toy Story, which I showed in part one. And if you guys don't mind, I might, I might drink uh, some Mountain Dew. In this video because I'm really thirsty so yeah I do have a Mountain Dew for me to drink because I've been, I've been getting thirsty so I might drink that sometimes when I show tapes in this video guys and then when Dalmatians 2 this said Japanese import I don't know what happened there looks like it got a little folded there I don't know how that happened it happened recently here's the ink label tan lid and label Came with this. Really cool. Sworn to Stone. May 17th, 2003. That was, by the way, that one was a Mexican Spanish. This one's the Japanese VHS Hollow Man. PG 12 rated. Kramer vs. Kramer, Blockbuster Weekly Hire. <clears throat> Movies Plus, Six Wallace Square, Melton, Australia, something. This is an Australian import.
Blockbuster rental. Next two are also from Australia, including this one. Gandai. Stereo Gold. Excuse me. Oliver. Here's a sticker label. End label. Customers, please, rewind tape after use. Do not use pause button. For minor static or lines, adjust tracking control. Do not handle tape in any way. Do not expose tape to excess heat or moisture. Store cassettes away from magnetic fields. I.e. All, electri uh, all electrical equipment. Independence Day. Hologram from Tony's Fox Entertainment. Pretty cool case. A robot. Also, I have cheaper by a dozen UK VHS, but unfortunately, that one uh, broke pretty much. I'm trying to splice that one currently. Um, with, uh, but I definitely will get a new copy in the future. I did get the UK DVD of that one recently. So, yeah, that's a start. I'll try to get the UK VHS when I find it on eBay again, or whenever I can order again. This, uh, I believe my only import from Chile, Mary Poppins, country Chile. This movie did win five Oscars. According to the box art. <clears throat> Terminator 3, Rise of the Machines. Tape. October 16th, 2003. This next one is kind of an inappropriate cover. Please advise and do not take this video down. Do not flag this video. I'll cover some of it up. Yeah. Even though his junk it does it is covered up by clouds. Bruce Almighty. This is the UK import from Touchdown. Covers kind of inappropriate though I'm not I do not need this video to get flagged because the bot is stupid it doesn't even know what what breaks the rules and what doesn't Buena Vista logo hologram right there December 6 2003 I got is really import of the Aristocats Here's the tape. I got an Israel import, Israeli import tape today as well. We'll get to that in a little bit. Stitch the movie. This is the Australian import VHS. The sear label and the end label. Inside artwork. Snowing Seven Doors. This is the 2001 South Korean VHS. There's the tape. And label. Both very colorful. Very beautiful with artwork and everything. Man, South Korea has some of the coolest looking tapes, I tell you. I want to get more of those. That's just neat. Good girl. Display a little. No, print tape. Lion King. This is the import from Saudi Arabia. Ultra rare. Buy with good girls from the UK. Came with this. Oh. 
And I also have Toy Story. Look at that. McDonald's coupon. Only available in Kuwait, which is in Africa, I believe. I mean, no, no it's not in Africa. It's in, um, it's near Cameroon, the country. <laughs> oh, this one is. And this expired on December 31st, 1996, that McDonald's coupon. Oh, come on, come on, there. Next is a Brazilian VHS. Oh, that's supposed to be with the slip. Oh, uh, maybe it won't. All right, that's fine. You know, that's fine. Buzz Lightyear Star Command. This is actually a Brazilian VHS. Tape. Black lid. Red tape. Houseboat and Catch a Thief. Double feature. Found this at my art thrift store. This is one of the first UK uh, releases I ever picked up. Both of these have no print date. What's so funny, Drew? What's so funny, man? What is it? Why are you laughing, Drew? Something funny? Broadcast news. Label's pretty much destroyed. No print date. Trying to get another series box video. UK tape that doesn't have a label that's destroyed. Season of the rookie is just that's, that's weak. Ah, come on. Case okay, being weird. Look at that sticker. Nine year old ninety nine pounds. So get suggested retail price. Nice. Pretty nice Seabus Fox Field uh, yes. sticker right there. Oh, come on. Come on. Rated 15. Obviously a UK import, just like the previous one. Titanic. There's the tape. Print date, June 26, 1998. Has the hologram right there. Well, at the beginning of the tape, it says June 27, 1998. Evolution. Another UK. Rented from Blockbuster. Be a friend. Rewind when you reach the end. Blockbuster video. Wow, what a difference. It also says right here, warning if the label's broken, you must purchase this video. Blockbuster sticker and the hologram, which is our home video hologram. So you know it's genuine. Black cauldron. So I will no print date. Alright. Hollow Man, this is a UK import, just like Black Cauldron. The play is human. To re rewind is divine. Blockbuster, wow, what a difference. Whoops. I didn't mean to do that. Up at Treasure Island. This is a Malaysian import from Malaysia. That was peeling. This is my other Malaysian tape. 
January 23rd, 1997. Now, it's not, this is a Japanese VHS widescreen. Tan lid. Copyright program, unor unauthorized duplication prohibited. That's what it says right there. Pre recorded VCT use only. Still label. And label. Has a tan lid, too. That's neat for Dreamworks tape. Top Gun, CIC Veil, oops. Still a label. Star Wars Episode 1, The Phantom Menace. Next two are, are UK imports, and Top Gun was from Japan, a uh, same with Mouse Hunt. Mouse Hunt's the only Japanese tape I have with the black screen of death at the end. I mean, not black screen of death, the uh, Japanese screen of death, I meant to say. Label. No print tape, got a hologram. Also got the sequel, Attack of the Clones. Special edition VHS includes exclusive deleted scenes, Star Wars connections featurette B2, I mean I mean R2, D2, and C3PO. Explain the story of the Star Wars saga. I also have an Australian import DVD of this movie. So we will put uh, no per date. Same thing. Episode 1 had no previews. This one has previews at the beginning. Next one's Ultra Rare. 2003 Special Edition VHS of Pinocchio. That's Ultra Rare. It actually has the Black Diamond logo at the beginning. It's the, the controversial one everybody was talking about. Got it for my birthday last year. My birthday is next month. September 27, 2003. I'll be 18 years old, by the way. I'm going to be an adult. Alright. Jurassic Park. UK Import. CIC. Yes, I do. I have multiple U.S. copies. Shark Tale. This is a Italian import. Black Reels. Until April 21st, 2005. At the beginning, it says April 22nd, 2005. Some of the other ones have different print dates at the beginning, too. It's kind of interesting. Chicken Run. Yeah. Excuse me. Another Italian import. August 6, 2001. Kazam, this is a Singapore import. Very rare. From Singapore. Only Singaporean type I have right now. Plan to get more soon. Per date, December 19, 1996. Petiak, Petiak. Petiac original videotape. Also, is that inside the case? This is from Singapore. Film's pretty bad, though. I got it mainly because it's the only Singapore import I could find online. One and only. Path A. No per date. Olive, the other, I mean, Olive, 
I'll have the original, I mean the other reindeer. Is that what it's called? This is a Mexican Spanish. Only fox mix. Actually, wait, no, no, that's not true anymore. I do have one other fox Mexican Spanish table. We'll get to that in a little bit. October 14, 2000. We'll get to that when we get to slipcovers. I'm going to try to finish all this uh, tonight. I mean, uh, in this part, I'm going to try to show you guys all the rest of my tapes in this part. There are four. Final donations. This is another Mexican Spanish. There's the tape. For date, October 17th, 1995. Here's Goofy. Lid broke off. Well, actually, it came with no lid, actually. No print date I can see. That's a pretty cool hologram. This is a Swedish tape as well from Sweden. My other Swedish tape. Die another day. No per date. Next one I got today actually. Home in the range is an Israeli import, ultra rare. And basically came with a thank you note. Still available. No protect. That's what it looks like. Tape actually goes like this, I think. I think that's actually how you open it. 1982, 26 Fox Video, VHS Domino Principle, rated M, as a video game rating, that's weird. Printed and manufactured in Australia. 1982, 26 Fox Video, South Pacific. It shall be an infringement copyright for this video except to be manufactured, sold, or left for hire in the public South Africa. UK import of the Lion King. September 8, 1995. Planning to get Fox and Hound for and release sometime. This is Doubtfire. Have anything to say so far, Drew? Um, October 14, 2004. I have it, yeah. Cool. How girl Al Stella got her groove back. No for date. Mr. Jonah Arc, two thousand one. UK import. Same with how Stella got her groove back and Mrs. Doubtfire and the Lion King. Which were the last four. April 16, 2001. German import of robots. This came in factory sealed when I got it. I plan to get the German VHS of Ice Age sometime as well. And maybe a couple other Fox German tapes that are home entertainment. Lion King Special Edition. This is an Italian import. That one has no per day at the beginning either. So that one really has no per day, period. Last Action Hero, UK. Cool. I do too. My copy's printed the 53rd week in 1993. Mine's 52nd week. I also have another copy printed the 36th week in 1994. Bugs Life. This is a Hebrew tape. Also from Israel. This one's from Israel too. Just like my Wrist Cats one. And Home in the Range. I, think, I believe I also have one other. We'll get to that one soon enough. 
We haven't gotten to it yet. Sleepless in Seattle. 2002 reprint. Yeah, December 24, 2002. Fifth element to say Thailand import. And cases in Thailand are like impossible to open with one hand. You have to open it with both hands. It's just those kind of cases that are just a pain in the you know what. Ten lid. That's pretty cool. All right, we got the Octagon Village Roadshow Home Video. There's the spine of it. And the sticker label and the end label. Plan to get more Village Roadshow Australian tapes sometime. Live packaging Australia. That's pretty cool. <coughs> oh, excuse me. Sorry about that. Anastasia, Italian import. Whoa! This has an old Fox logo on the back. It has the 1953 Fox logo on the back. That's weird. I just noticed that. I came with just a little bonus promo material. This is from Buena Vista Home Video. This is just bonus uh, promo material. Oh, wow. Happy Meal cheeseburger comes with, along with fries and other stuff. Expired March 31st of 2000. Pretty cool that he added some bonus pro material from the Milan Italian VHS. I'm assuming he had. He gave me some bonus pro material, which is really nice. Very hard pro material to find, too. Oh, it also. Oh, yeah, never mind. I already showed that. It was that flyer thingy for Anastasia. I showed that before I showed all this stuff, I believe. All these uh, Disney pro material. Advertising McDonald's and a Bug's Life. Alright. And then it advertised two other advertisements. A little better looking inside. Ah, look at that. Some cool pro material from Titanic. Inspired December 31st, 1998. Some sort of offer. Is that the U.S. Nice Five for 20 minutes an hour. Uh, what? Oh, Titanic. Is that the U.S. copy? Uh, no. It's for the Italian copy. That's what you're asking. The promo. The promo. Still label. Uh, end label. Per day at the beginning of the tapes, number 6, 1998. Toys Fox Home Entertainment. Very nice case. See. Beautiful. Oops. There. Alright. We got 101 Dalmatians. This one actually turned out to be a bootleg. Oh yeah, look. Bootleg security sticker. Wow. This one is a bootleg, apparently. I popped it in. It plays like a bootleg, too. That's how I know it's a bootleg, for sure. I actually got a bootleg is really tape. So that was the other Israeli tape I have. Tarzan Jane. This is Mexican Spanish. Per date, November 28, 2002. Got a Brazilian VHS of Winnie the Pooh. A Very Merry Pooh Year. 2002 VHS. Waltz Seal Entertainment. This is my second Waltz Seal Entertainment Brazilian tape. Ring South Korean VHS. Got this one yesterday. Yeah. 
accidentally got some stuff on my phone. I had to clean it up. Blue tape. DreamWorks lid. NCJ Entertainment. Yeah, that's the inside of the case. Very nice. Conan and Destroyer, CUK port. So I will no print it. My private Idaho. This is a Australian. Sticker label and label. Blue lid. Advertising Fox Video. Soon, White Man Can't Jump. And then Fox Video South Pacific. Alright. We got about three stacks left. So I'm an Axe Murderer. Romanian VHS import. What's a country near Hungary, I believe? Monsters and Co. This is Italian VHS of Monsters Inc. Blue tape. Just like here in America. A sticker label and a sticker label and label. Men in Black 2. This is a UK VHS. January 4, 2003. Yes. Perfect Storm. This is an import from France. This is my only other C cam tape I have. Label. No print date, even though it has printings. Casper. This is a import from Germany. CIC. Still kept the ink label intact. No per date despite... Oh, oh wait, is there? Actually, wait. Yes, there is a per date. April 2nd, 1996 or is it February 4th, 1996? It's one of those two. If it's the foreign way, it's February 4th, but if it's not, then it's April 2nd. It's hard to tell. Uh, I think it's actually February 4th now that I think about it. I think they do it the, the foreign way. I think it's February 4th, probably. 1996. So, though, too. It's the UK version, as you could probably already tell. I did order two foreign releases of Stuart Little recently to make up for uh, losing the UK version. Uh, November 9th, 2002. So yeah, they should be coming in quick, like maybe even as soon as tomorrow or sometime next week. I hope it does. Oh man, my home in the range uh, Israeli VHS came pretty late. I don't know what's going on with the post office lately. Big Shot's funeral. Excuse me. That one doesn't appear to be a rental. I might be wrong about that, though. Goldfinger. Thailand import. The Aristocats. Print date says either June seventh. Uh, oh wait, is that right? Yeah, June seventh, nineteen ninety five, or is it July sixth, nineteen ninety five? It looks like June seventh right, because I believe that's the UK way. Matilda. Can't see a print date on there. So it's probably the original 1996 pressing, even though it has no previews. So it might be a reprint. Just Maybe it just doesn't have a print date. 
We got an Italian import of Aladdin Special Edition. We got two stacks left, around around two stacks left. We got the sticker label, black reels, and the end label. Birthday at the beginning says September 3rd, 2005. Mouse Hunt, this is a UK import. So I will, don't see a print date on this one. Despite printings. Oh wait, oh, oh wait, maybe there isn't any printing. I might have to look at that again. Ponyo, Japanese VHS. Very rare. Walt Disney uh, Castle. Walt Disney Studios Home Entertainment. Big Blue, this is an import from Thailand as well. Go produce the CBS video. Australian import hair parch ever secrets. Plan to get the original on the Australian import as well. And the per date, uh, I forgot to mention. I, I could actually see it despite it being underneath in there. July 12th, 10th, it looks like. The Incredibles, this is an Italian import. I uh, did reveal the print date to this one, January 13th, 5 It has the exact same print date at the beginning as well. So, yeah. It was actually printed uh, 11 days before my VHS copy. Better copy. Same as my dead copy as well. So, my Legend of Seven Seas. It's my only release of this one I have so far. I plan to get another copy sometime. UK import. October 16th, 2004. Film was a box I was bomb though. I do have the Town 3 American DVD as well. I have that too. This a my other Polish VHS, Big Daddy. Here's the tape. Looks pretty much the same as that other Deep End of the Ocean tape I showed in part one. Warner Home Video Boring Shield case. That's rather interesting. No, Australian import of Aladdin, 1994. No, I had enough detail. Shut up. I don't have... Oh dear. Two label. And label. Alright, guys, sorry about that. Drew apparently had a fight. That's okay. You know, we all have fights sometimes. Chicken run. And guys, don't make fun of him for it. It happens to all of us sometimes. Okay. That's chicken run. We're almost done. We have one full stack left, pretty much. Lock stock and two smoking barrels. There's actually a Mars commercial advertisement at the beginning of the tape. So we will... Yeah, let's see. Birth date. Which is okay. Move on. From Russia with love. This is a Thailand import. Ooh, that's a hard one to open too, just like the others. Show and an end label. Pretty much the same end label as the MGM Thailand import tape I have. We got a UK import of City Slickers. This is the spine, first the pendant pictures, and here is the back. Not on Santa White till March 1993. Sticker label, and we got the hologram for first independence. And at the beginning, it birthday says March 6, 1992, which I have uploaded the beginning of the tape to YouTube. Even though not the full opening, but just you know the start of it. Lo Locus Videos Group BB. Pokemon Forever. Australian import. Sticker label got an end label. Miramax tape, 
and that's what the inside of the case looks like. Uh, this is the other South Korean tape I have. I'm not getting rid of it. LG Red Live. Unreal. Yeah, that one definitely not getting rid of. That one's rare. Two more for the uh, um, the the cut box ones or whatever you call them, the box ones. Transporter before we get to slip cases. This is the Italian import. Oh, blockbuster date is September, uh, May 9th, or September 5th. You guys are like this. Black Reels, which is rare for a Fox tape in general. Per favor, Roger Velci, quando arrive at la fun. Blockbuster, wow, what a difference. Oh, wow. Attention. Si questa esurata e strapata dovrei copiare questa cassetta. I tried my best to read it. That's Italian. Per date is blocked at the moment. That's fine, though. CIC case. That's rare. Can't wait to find out what the print date is when I pop the tape in. I just need to get my PAL VCR fixed. I can't wait to pop in this last one, too, along with the Home and Arrangers real tape. This is a, it, my only Greek import. I'm getting two more in the mail. They should be coming pretty soon. 101 No Mix 2, Pest London Adventure. This is a, a Greek import. Audiovisual Enterprises SA license for Greek and for, for Greek and Cyprus. Those two countries. All right. Here's the single label, and there is no print date. It has that hologram. All right. Now let's get to these slip cases. We're almost done. Madneck video release of Hello Dolly. This is a South Pacific one. It's from Australia. Very rare. I tried popping it in, but it got really, like, like the screen started getting really messed up, so I took it out. So that little end label. I'm guessing it doesn't really work that well, unfortunately, because it's old. That's okay. Even though I did pay $25 for it. Mexican Spanish of something about Mary. At least I do have another copy of that one, though. <clears throat> and per date is August 5th, 1999, if you do it in a foreign way. I believe Mexico does it the foreign way. Conspiracy Theory. Per date is August 17th, 1998. Watch Good Epperings. That's a sing along song tape for Hercules. Red Heat. And I do have an Australian import of Gigi as well. That one I didn't end up bringing, I didn't end up uh, putting in here. But I have that one as well. And here's the ink label. Per day is December 10th, 1996. I believe it says. Is that correct? Let me see. Uh, I don't know if I could see. Oh, wait, no, 1999. Crap. Sorry, I got confused. All right, the last two are three movie sets. Top actually got torn off on that one. Hang on. Tape one, tape two, tape three. See, tape one, no print date. Tape two, no print date. Tape three, September 28th, I believe. Alright. Final tape. Only one of these work. Aaron Brockovich is the only one out of the three that work. The other two don't work. I've, I've tr yeah, I've tried putting them in and they refuse to play. Lead broke off a of dirty dancing. Is the other. Uh, the only one with the print date is Bridget Jones' Diary. Print date on that one. Let's check it. That one is... Let's see. December 21st of 2001. Alright. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I will see you guys in my next video. Take care.